Hey y'all, it's Rosie from iHeartRecipes.com and I'm going to show you how to make the best pineapple glazed ham. So if this recipe looks familiar to some of my older subscribers, it's because this recipe was uploaded about five to six years ago. I just changed a couple steps up, so let me show you what I do new. So you'll need a ham between eight to 10 pounds. We're going to decorate the ham using pineapple rings, cherries, and we're going to use toothpicks to hold everything in place. So I'm using canned pineapple rings and jarred cherries. Both came in juice, so the cherries had cherry juice and the pineapples had pineapple juice. I reserved the juice and I set it to the side. So here are the juices. I'm going to combine them at this time. As you see, there are some cherries left over. If you have anything left over, you can do like I do. I just snack on it while I'm cooking. So combine those two and now we're going to add in some honey as well. And now we can start adding in some yellow mustard. Followed by the yellow mustard, I'm going to start adding in some dark or brown sugar. And then I'm going to sprinkle in a combination of ground cinnamon, ground nutmeg, a little bit of ground clove, and a little bit of ground ginger. Once everything's in there, I'm going to stir it until it's well combined. And then I'm going to start adding in some cornstarch. So the cornstarch is a new step for me. I like to use the cornstarch because it thickens up the glaze, okay? So mix everything until well combined. And then we're going to walk over to the stovetop. So here on my stovetop, I have my saucepan. I'm going to pour in the glaze and then I'm going to turn my heat up to medium high. So once this glaze starts to boil, you will see how thick it will be, okay? So once it reaches this point, that's how thick your uh, glaze will be point blank period. If you think you need to add more cornstarch, you can, but if you ask me, this is thick enough. I believe that that right there is perfection, so I'm good here. Nothing else needs to be done to my glaze. I'm going to turn the heat off, and then I am going to pour the glaze all over the ham. And pineapple glazed ham is one of my favorite holiday dishes. What are yours? Let me know down below in the comment section. I am dying to know. Now, if you're not subscribed to my YouTube channel, make sure you subscribe. Turn on those notifications so you know whenever I upload a recipe, which is always Sundays and Wednesdays at 1 p.m. Pacific Standard Time. And also follow me on my other social media outlets. So now we're going to bake this in the oven on 325 Fahrenheit uncovered for 30 minutes. After that 30 minutes, you're going to remove the ham out of the oven, baste it. You want to make sure all that glaze is all over the ham. And then you'll place it back in the oven for an additional 20 to 30 minutes. Once done, this is the finished look. And I kid you not, this is the very best pineapple glazed ham. You don't need any other recipes. You're done here, okay? Thank you so much for watching. Head over to my blog, iHeartRecipes.com, to print out this recipe. And don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already.